You know, there's a verse, and uh, it's one of my favorite verses in the whole entire Bible. It comes from the book of Romans, chapter 8, and uh, verse 15. I'm going to put it on the screen for you now. I love this. Because I don't know if you've ever had a time where the enemy has said, hey, your marriage has fallen apart. You can't fix this. You know what? You can't even pay your mortgage. Yeah, how are you going to be a great parent? You know what? I saw what you looked at last night. How can you stand and come to church on Sunday morning? I saw the way you treated that kid in the playground. I know that you got none, zero out of 10 in your last test. You are no good. Here's the thing. The enemy comes. The enemy comes to me today and says, Sean, you can't preach. You can't speak. You're going to stuff up. Something's going to go wrong. You can, who are you to stand up here? And you know what? Who am I? I'm 32. I live in a caravan. In America, that's called trailer trash. You know what? And that's what the enemy does. He says, you're away all the time, Sean. How can you expect that your kids are going to follow Jesus? You're away all the time. But you know what? Sometimes we got to remind ourselves who we are. And look at this. It says, you haven't received a spirit that makes you fearful slave. You know what a slave, you know what a slave is? A slave doesn't have any inheritance. A slave just works and goes. They don't belong. They're not family. They're just there to work. But look at this. Instead, you've received God's Spirit when He adopted you as His own children. Do you know what that means? That means God says, you're right. On your own, you're nothing. But with me, I call you son. With me, I call you precious daughter of the Most High King. Kids, you've got to understand God is not just some guy sitting in a castle in heaven. He is the king of the universe. He speaks and it happens. He makes a promise. He keeps it forever. And he says, I call you my own. Maybe your daddy doesn't live at home. You know what? God doesn't forget about you. God says, I call you my precious son. I call you my daughter. You know what? We got to remember ourselves, adults. We are sons and daughters of the most high God. We are still, yes, you're an adult. Yes, you're mature. Yes, you might own your house and have five investment properties. Maybe you've got nothing to your name, but you are still a son. You're still a daughter, and we can come running. And tonight, I want to encourage you that, you know what? It's time we remember who we are in Christ.